Are you looking for fun and educational PBT games to transform your classroom? Look no further. This video features 10 must-have PBT games guaranteed to engage your students. First up, we have Frozen 2 Fever. You press on this button right here. And this game is about making the biggest snoogie out of snowballs. Press on the button right here. You need to select a letter and then choose a snowflake. Some snowflakes will have bombs and some will have scenes from the frozen. If you're gonna get a snoogie, we can press on the picture right here to make the snoogie grow. First player making the biggest snoogie will win this game. This PowerPoint game doesn't have any question slides. Before playing this game and being on this slide, you can ask students questions and then when they answer correct, you can let them choose a letter and also you need to divide them into four teams or two or three teams pull the screw and his minions you can't stop the inevitable my bomb will shatter this pathetic planet Soon, I, Victor, will rule the glorious dust cloud that remains. Muaha! Next up, we have Minions Save the Planet Earth. We have four players in this game. You divide your students into two to four teams. Then you press on this timer. And students need to cut a wire and get rewards or penalties depending on the wire. Super interesting and fun game to play with your students. <laughs> this game also will have scenes from the movie. We got three points you can add to a player. In this game you need to save the earth and cut the wire faster before Vector will destroy the planet. Angry Birds is one of my favorite games. We have two teams, piggies and birds. So players need to choose the bird. Then select right here. And then another team will select the piggy. And then press start. And then you press on the spinner and miss and blast. You press on the piggy. Also in this game you can have questions right here you can press on a question mark and you're gonna get a question to ask a student and then you can keep on playing this game and who gonna get the the egg then you add to this team <laughs> Another fun game, One Piece, Lucky Drawer. In this game, you can start your game with questions or without questions. Let's press with questions. You press start right here. This is the dice for you to choose who will start first. And then you can press on a tick to confirm how many players do you have. You also can choose a character here by pressing on this arrow 
and when you're satisfied with your selection you can press ok like this and so on and press on the dice to hide and then you need to choose the card then you answer a question and we have a wrong and correct answer and if you correct you're gonna get points 8 points plus 9 points altogether you're gonna get 17 points and who gonna get the most points will win this game Aspiring Pokemon Trainers! Pokemon is uh, another great game. You have two players. Press on the blue button. And then players need to select a letter like this. The question will appear and all the questions will be behind one another. And you can modify and save the PowerPoint and you will be good to go. When a student answers a question, you press on a question box. To hide the question because there's no reward for this but if you're gonna get for example a berry like here you press on a berry and then you select a location to catch the pokemon press on a pokeball gonna get three points press on a black button to give three points and again player with the highest points will be the winner claw machine is my oldie but goodie also very fun game and very popular game you have four teams press continue and players need to select a letter Money, 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 money. We don't have any coins behind this letter. For example, here we got a coin. You press on a coin and then press on a coin right here. Now you can move the claw to the right, press on the right. Press again and choose the toy you want to catch. For example, let's say this middle toy. Press on the catch button. So we got the toy, so we're gonna give the team one point. And so on, continue playing this game until you're going to run out of all the letters and win the game with the most points. Also be aware you can catch a bomb instead of the toy. <laughs> Next up we have Doraemo, four characters. So in this game, this is a board game, you need to get to the temple and press on the smiling face. We've got a lot of questions. Press on the question and press on the smiling face. Then you're gonna get this big slot machine. If you're gonna get this bell, this will have two moves forward and propeller, one move and snack, no moves. So we got one move, let's go back and you press on the talking to move the character. And the first person reaches the tempo will win the game. We do have question slides in this game, you just need to press on a button, hyperlink to the next slide number 4. For example, we have all question slides right here, you can modify the question and also incorrect correct answer and also add an image and then just save the PowerPoint and you will be good to go. And 
Tom and Jerry, another very fun game, also one of my favorite. You have two to four players. So how to play this game? Press on an arrow, select the letter, gonna get a question, and then press on the question box, and then press on an arrow. Also you need to remember that you're gonna get a point. There will be points behind letters. And then you need to select the mouse hole. So rewards will be like this. If you're going to get a mouse, you can double your points. But if Jerry gets you, you're not gonna double any points. Same goes if Spike gets you, you also will not get double points. TikTok is a warm-up dance, so let me show you how to use it and you need to select a song First you can listen to a song, let's say like this Then you press one more time to stop the melody then press on an another one Okay, and then here here. And when you're satisfied with the song, you can select like this, press on select. You tell your students then you need to follow these movements, head swings, hip swing, foot stomps and punk mode. When they're ready, you press start. <laughs> Foot stomps, hip swings three times, head swings three times, punk mode three times. After that you can play one more time or come back to the selection of the songs. And that's it for this PowerPoint TikTok warm-up dance. Number one game that the most people like is inside out you have two games in one you press on a ball you have five characters joy disgust fear anger and sadness so what you should do here you need to press on the spinner and if you're gonna get two change this circle your color into your color Okay, so for example, if you're gonna get four the same color circles, you can occupy this space by pressing on this green because here we have green disgust. So press on this button. Disgust will disappear and no longer be in a game. And so on until you will conquer the whole brain with your emotion. Now let me show you the second game. So in the second game you have questions. So you press on this question mark and then you select the letter you're gonna get our question and also a point you can the same way change the ball to different color and win this game thanks for watching guys all these games are absolutely free to download you can find the link in the description and if you enjoyed this video give a like subscribe and stay tuned for more amazing and free powerpoint games i'll see you in my next video Peace.